Hello, I am Virtual Pix, and welcome to War for the Overworld. Now, this is a indie game. I think it was greenlit on Steam um, quite a while back uh, in its bedrock beta form, and I got in on it because I instantly recognised it as the classic Dungeon Keeper game, which was probably one of the best games that I ever played when I was younger. It was the pinnacle point in where I went to PC gaming. And I wanted to show it off. Oh, well, I forgot where I was at, and I went for the um, sandbox mode. Turns out that may not have been a great idea. So I'm going for a skirmish mode instead, and I'm now going to have to cut a whole crap ton of stuff out of this recording. But that's okay. Uh, okay. Didn't really want to have to do that, but that's okay because there is plenty we can do with that. Uh, we can make this the den area. That's perfectly fine. Uh, we'll make this the uh, slaughterhouse area, and we'll also bring an arcane library off of that. Uh, what else have we got? Ah, four levels, right, so... Beast den unlocked. Archive unlocked. Barracks unlocked. Foundry unlocked. There you go. Those are the three, those are the rooms that we want. We'll bring the foundry off there. And the archive, pretty much the same. Your vaults cannot store any more gold. No shit. Uh, I am going to need a vault somewhere, so... I may actually make this the vault and then bring the... Yeah, yeah, that makes more sense. I mean, uh, this would be going a lot faster if I had more workers. Insufficient manner. It's fine, that's enough. As long as I can start something. Oh, well, we, we will get there at some point. Um, I mean, this game kind of has a bit of a slow start up anyway, so I'm going to skip forward to a point where I've got the dungeon a little bit more filled out. Oh, right. Oh, oh well, I'm back, and we've now got much more filler dungeon. Things are coming along nicely. Uh, Blade Lotus unlocked. It's time to pay your minions, Underlord. Midas door unlocked. Foundry upgraded. I want to get one of these Midas doors in because they're really good. Bone uh, chiller. Defense constructed. Since that's the main entrance to my dungeon. And we're not looking too bad at the moment. We're all a little bit strapped for cash, but that's not a problem. Yes, we do. So, with any luck, we're building out nicely. Oh. You guys are just quite happily working away there. Uh, 
do, 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 do. actually Perception I... shrine clay. I'm gonna eliminate this section here. So it's a nice open area. If you were to construct that for me, please, minions. Underminer complete. Off we go. Um, give me a second. <laughs> Off we go. Time for us to start expanding outwards. And watch now as my minions spill forth and destroy. Blood will be spilt on this day. What lays beyond this wall? I wonder where my titan is. Oh, the fences are falling. Bit by bit, they're waning away. Hi, I'm Virtual Pix, and welcome to another vlog because I broke my recording. So I'm gonna record this bit on top of the <laughs> original recording because I recorded a whole video's worth of War of the Underworlds, and well, I this is adding on to the end of it of that same recording, and I'll just cut it if necessary, depending on how much of the War of the Underworlds video is actually salvageable. Um, I mean, the last part of it kind of broke anyway, and it was just like, yeah, no, we're not, we're not doing this for you today. No, we're, we're just going to, like, we might have worked yesterday, but we're not working today. You're going to have to wait. So, I don't really know what to do about that, because my computer's just being a bitch today, pretty much. It's just like, nope, I'm not working. You want me to work? We'll just screw you, because I'm not. Um, hopefully this will actually make for some extra entertaining material, if I don't have much to salvage. Um, if I do actually manage to salvage something, I'm going to put it in here, and hopefully it will be something. I don't think it's going to be much though, because every time I looked up at the recording, it was lagging. So I might actually do another recording and have this vlog as a bonus video. So I'll release the vlog tomorrow, uh, today. Yeah, today. And I'll... I'm gonna go and actually record a second video, uh, probably be Terra Tech, and I'll put that up for you guys as well, because I don't think the War of the Over... War for the Overworld actually went too well. I think my RAM may have, um... Be decidedly disgusted at me right now. It's a very intense game, uh, but it is on Steam, um, and I'm actually going to link it uh, in this vlog below so that you can check it out. Because if any of you out there have played Dungeon Keepers One and Two and loved them, then you'll love War of the o Over well War for the Overworld because it's basically Dungeon Keeper Three. I mean, I personally, it's just a retitled Dungeon Keeper 3, because obviously Bullfrog went bust. So, this vlog will have a secondary title of It's Good to Be Bad, because it is. Anyway, that uh, does it for this video. Uh, it's going to be a cut-up, chopped-up mess of a vlog, and I don't know what's going to come out of it. So... I'm going to do an extra video on top of this one today, which will be a TerraTech video. And hopefully my computer will actually behave for that one. So thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button. Stay awesome as always. And I will see you in the next video.